Welcome back to the channel guys, today I'll be playing some Starfield and the new Shattered Space DLC. Now the game has promised quite a lot of DLCs that are going to be released in the future but this is the first complete one and this is something you do have to purchase separately unless you own the premium edition you do get this free so just be aware of that. Just going to quickly go through the in-game settings now. So playing at a resolution of 3840 by 2160 but because I'm using borderless full screen mode it takes on the resolution of your desktop so that's why it's greyed out. Now I'm playing at ultra way highest or high way highest. The only thing I've got disabled is motion blur and I'm using DLAA as the anti-aliasing method and I'm also using NVIDIA's uh, frame generation as well but I won't be using variable rate shading that does degrade quality in areas that you shouldn't notice but if you just want the game to look as best as possible there's no need to use it so that's pretty much it for the in-game settings obviously DLSS was a bit of a controversial subject in this game because it wasn't available at launch and it was said that AMD made sure that um, basically FSR was the only choice available but whether or not that's true um, we've got it now and that's what, that's what counts so I'm happy with it and I'm able to use frame generation and DLAA as I'm using NVIDIA hardware. Anyway, this is the Shattered Space DLC. Um, to start the DLC, you just gotta go to a, a vacant system with no mission, and then you get you get held by this space station called Oracle. You dock and you basically start the DLC, and that's exactly what I've done. So let's, let's get in here. See if we can find out who made that emergency call. So performance is a lot better now. The game even utilizes literally all of my 4900KS, which is nice to see. I cannot give up. Oh, it just disappeared. I wonder what happened here. Sure, we'll get some answers soon. I'm not going to judge performance right now. Obviously, we're inside a building, so we'll see what happens when we're out in the field amongst a lot of NPCs. Our instrumentation is rated for long-term exposure to this level of cold. I'm trying, Sarah, but it's getting worse. I can feel my mind slipping. Fragmenting. I'll become one of them. You have to get away from me. No, I will not leave you here. It's pointless. We share this fate. This is our end. The great... No. No, it's happening. Sarah, run. I can't stop it. Yeah, what's going on here? How did I know that was going to happen? Damn, I was just up. Oh, Sarah was ready for the for the action. I see no one, and yet I can feel a presence. But how? I should be the last. Is someone there, or? My mind turns against me. I must return to engineering and make one last attempt to restore the power. Okay, he's gone. I'm not too sure what the hell's going on here, but something crazy's happened. Oh, there's the body. Well, it disappeared. I'm sure they had something we can use. Don't worry, we got the key now. Pretty sure there's bodies or enemies waiting everywhere. Let me get my weapon ready. Yep, thought so. Let's 
one down. Two down. And there's one more. about when you're in zero gravity the four sort of shots just throw you back I'm sure there'll be more of those guys where that came from what do we have here Look an audio log this is Irak Vettel post incident log Something has gone horribly wrong. We were in orbit directly above Dazra, monitoring our current experiments when we experienced a sudden energy surge. I fear the source came from the city itself. It triggered our graph drive and jumped the Oracle to an unknown location. We thought members of the crew were somehow lost in the jump. But later, we were attacked by what I will refer to as Vortex Phantoms. I thought I recognized some of them. Could it be that the energy surge has somehow transformed them and warped their minds? Okay, at least we know a little bit of what's going on here. Okay, we've got to find another way around. Go over here. Let's go down from here. Try to avoid this stuff. I don't know what it is. Another audio log, I think. Yep. This is Irak Vettel. Post incident log. After the initial jump. Areas of the Oracle have somehow been sectioned off by strange energy fields or barriers. The fields allow no one to pass and are somehow able to repel, almost teleport, the trespasser back. I am certain these new fields are related to the Vortex Phantoms. Both resonate with the same energy pattern. The exact same pattern we were studying for Anasco's experiments. Something happened in Dasra. And if the situation is bad here, I fear for our brethren in the city. Okay, looks like this situation hasn't been contained. That's bad news. Okay, now where do we go? I'm pretty much dying, so I better heal up. Straight ahead. Ah, I've got more company. I hate the way they can just disappear like that. Sure they'll show up another time. Okay, threat's gone for now, but I've just got to keep my wits about me. Where the hell? on that teleporting thing again. But try not to waste any bullets. We go down somehow. The space down here. It's not unusual for stations this large to have ample food. I think I see another area on the other side of these crates. How do we remove them? Not exactly grab them. We try shooting them or hitting them out the way. That works too. Let's use my torch now. Okay. Got 
got to find a way out of here. Another one down. Just keep bringing them, and I'll keep knocking them down. We'll navigate through here somehow. Okay, found a latch. So that guy made his way to engineering. We're still making our way there. It's the bathroom. Gun ready, but well, feeling I'm going to be ambushed. Yeah, ah. Thought as much. I think I have ammo. I didn't stock up on junk. A communal sleeping area. Not much in terms of privacy now, is it? Is there a key card here or something? Why are we even down here? Okay, we go up here somewhere. the key card. <laughs> Stop! I mean, there's one of, one of these things around every corner. Okay, I've got what I need. I'm just going to save it just in case, you never know. Just a quick save what they're for because these enemies are pretty strong okay now that we got access to engineering we might be able to find that other guy not sure if this is the right way to go let's check if this is a health pack it is. Yeah, you gotta find a way out of here. Maybe we go back through the hatch. There's nothing in here that I need. Okay, we can get through these doors now. one more. I wonder if Sarah took care of that one. I'm going to go and double check. Here it is. Oh, 
Alright. That's both of them down. Let's take the bullets. So we're gonna need them. Okay, where to now? Somewhere above us. Over here somewhere. Gonna get, gonna get through here earlier. And go through now. Doors open. One of the power cells dislodged in the last jump. The gravity. The restoring the gravity may pull the cell into place. If I can get to the control room, if I can just... No! They are coming! Take these guys out as quickly as I can. I don't even need a gun. There's the last one. On Sarah. Okay. Eliminated. Let's see what they had on them. Set aside anything useful and just leave the rest. It's got some more ammo, really. That was it. Did not make this place easy to uh, navigate. Guess and this is where all the trash came through. Squeeze through here. These damn controls! Why will they not respond to me? Work, damn you! Warning. Gravity procedure initiated. Please check your surroundings to ensure personal safety. Restoring gravity in three, two, one. Finally, 
back on our feet for the first time. I'm gonna make another quick save just in case. Check if I got anything to heal me. Taking quite a beating. Not really. We'll have to try and find a health pack around here somewhere. This must be the waste disposal area. Hopefully the sensors don't consider us rubbish. We should be so lucky. Okay, we're gonna get ourselves down. Oh, we do have a jetpack. Boat milk. Maybe that can heal me. A little bit. There's a console over here I need to press. The okay, power's now restored. Power cell connected. Report to operations for system reboot. Okay, we finally got things under control here. What a mess. Phantoms. Where did they go? Something is wrong. Got something new? I, mean, I got one of those automatic <laughs> alien guns. No! Not now! I have to hold on! We're gonna have to fight this guy now. Took him down, I think. Finally, luckily, I picked up this weapon at the best time. Might as no well way take I what we can. All right. All right. Full system reboot. Mainframe reboot initiated. Commencing protocol. Station lockdown completed. All major systems on standby. Mainframe reboot completed. Warning, station jump procedure initiated. Please check your surroundings to ensure personal safety. Jump in three, two, one. Execute. Jump completed. Station lockdown released. Initiating data transfer. Okay, maybe now we can get out of here. Incoming transmission. This is Dasra calling the Oracle Station. We've received your transmission. Your orders are to send a representative down here immediately. It appears we have much to discuss. Sirak held out as long as they could. Oh, it's unfortunate they couldn't live to see this. Nice. 
so at least we uh, survived. Alright, let's go and meet these people. Find out what's going on here. into a mad situation. Barely survived. Game's playing really well though. Very still, and choose your words carefully. They will determine how long you live. Let's all just take a moment. I assure you, we mean you no harm. You have no right to be here. You will tell me how you found this place. Yeah, it's a long story. But it was lost. All communication ceased. There was no sign of it. Indeed it did. The Oracle is perhaps the least of our problems, I'm afraid. Forrest, I think we need not fear our guest. Perhaps, in this time of need, the Great Serpent has delivered us a gift. Counselor, with due respect, we have not had unannounced visitors here in generations. It is a clear breach of security. I do not disagree, and I know that security, in whatever small form we can grasp it, is of paramount importance. But you must acknowledge the timing is... curious. And perhaps our guest's intent should be determined before we take further action. Yeah, at least this guy's got some sense. We received the automated transmission, but you are certainly not who we expected to find. Great Serpent! What's happening again? Hear me! Speaker, we are here! We have reached out to you, to, to seek guidance in our hour of need. The gate in the Citadel has been opened just to seek you! It's like what we saw on the station. Have I failed you? What is this place? Where am I? Why do you not show yourself? I strive only to follow your command. All must serve. Please, do not leave me in darkness. Oh, great serpent. Is... Is that you? Is it your presence, I feel? I... I feel something, yet... I see nothing. Is this a test? What do you require of me? Answers. 
Great Serpent, I have done all that I can. The Scaled Citadel itself has been transformed to petition you. I know that all must serve, but I need more. I require guidance. Take pity on us and reveal the way forward. We wish no harm upon you, outsider. Our leader, Anasko Varun, he has appeared like this over and over. So many of our people have been trapped in this state, these vortex phantoms. But usually they are hostile and lash out. Anasko is different. If only we could hear his voice, some reassurance that all is not lost. You could hear him. Despite the sightings, none have heard the word from Anasco in all this time, yet you claim to. Do not toy with me. Not about this. If you speak truth, you must prove it. What did he say? Oh, my serf. I, the serpent. Are you quite sure? I was right here and I didn't hear a thing. It is hard to believe. And yet, no outsider would know our creed. It is never uttered beyond this city. Truly, you did hear an asko. You have been chosen. Chosen for what? People of House Varun, hear me. We have asked the Great Serpent for deliverance from our calamity. And he has answered us. This outsider has been chosen as the most unlikely vessel for the Great Serpent's divine provenance. And he will help save us all. Outsider, please. There is no denying you have been sent here as a sign. You must help us. But there are... Uh, there are precepts that must be followed, principles that must be obeyed. Even in these dire circumstances, we cannot turn from Jinan Varun's teachings. You will be granted safe passage through Dazra and the lands beyond. No harm will come to you. On that, you have my word. You even have my assurance that your... compatriot here will also remain unharmed. But to truly aid us, you must become part of House Varun. This is not a thing done lightly, and it cannot be taken back. Will you commit to helping us by becoming one of the promised? What choice do I have? Excellent. But please, come with me. Forgive me for not introducing myself. I am Malibor Dulkef, a member of the High Council of House Varun. <laughs> 